Welcome to a new video where we delve into the world of dropshipping tools. Today, we spotlight two major players, Importify and Spocket. Importify, a popular tool, is designed to streamline the process of importing products from various suppliers into your online store. It's about making your life easier and your business more efficient. On the other hand, we have Spocket, a platform that connects you with thousands of suppliers worldwide. It's all about providing you with a plethora of quality products to fill your virtual shelves. Both tools play a pivotal role in the dropshipping market, each with its unique features and benefits. In this video, we're going to put these two platforms side by side, digging into their functionalities, examining their pros and cons, and ultimately, helping you decide which one suits your needs best. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the world of Importify and Spocket, and determine which platform reigns supreme. Now before we proceed with the comparison, let's get a clear picture of Spocket's performance in the market. Spocket has made a significant mark in the dropshipping industry. With over 1 million users, the platform has built a robust and thriving community of entrepreneurs. This impressive user base is served by a vast network of more than 30,000 suppliers. Spocket's reach is global, serving over 200 countries. This international presence ensures a diversity of products and markets for its users. When it comes to shipping, Spocket boasts an average shipping time of just 8 to 14 days. This is a significant advantage as quick shipping times can lead to higher customer satisfaction. Speaking of satisfaction, Spocket users have plenty to be happy about. The platform has a user satisfaction rate of over 80%, which is testament to the quality of its service and the effectiveness of its platform. These impressive stats position Spocket as a formidable contender. But how does it stack up against Importify? Let's find out. With a clear understanding of Spocket's performance, it's time to compare it with Importify. Let's kick things off with ease of use. Spocket's intuitive interface is easy to navigate, even for beginners. On the other hand, Importify also offers a user-friendly experience, but it might take a bit more time to get acquainted with its layout. Moving on to product range. Spocket primarily focuses on high-quality EU and US-based products. This might be a bit limiting, but it ensures quality control. Importify, however, provides a wider product range by sourcing from multiple platforms like AliExpress, Amazon, and DHgate. This can be a double-edged sword as it offers variety but might compromise quality. Next up is pricing. Both platforms come with free plans but their premium features differ. Spocket's pricing plans are a bit more expensive but they offer more features. Importify's plans are cheaper, but you might have to shell out more for additional features. Let's talk about customer support. Spocket has a reputation for its responsive and supportive customer service team. Importify also prides itself on customer support, but there have been mixed reviews about response times. Lastly, let's consider additional features. Spocket offers real-time inventory updates and branded invoicing. Importify, on the other hand, boasts a semi-automatic order fulfillment feature, which can be a game-changer for some businesses. Now that we've compared both platforms, which one takes the crown, let's wrap things up. After a thorough comparison, it's time to give our final verdict. Both Importify and Spocket offer unique features, but Spocket takes the lead with its superior performance statistics. It's user-friendly, offers more supplier diversity, and its product sourcing is top-notch. Importify, while a worthy competitor, falls slightly short, and there you have it. Two powerful tools, but one clear winner. Thanks for joining us in this comparison journey. Until next time, keep optimizing your dropshipping processes.